Okay, it's GCSE time. Now we've got a random question here just for you to practice on some vectors. So here it is. Have a quick read and see how we get on. So we've got M is the midpoint of CD. There we go. M is bang in the middle. And what you've got to find is C to D. So that one over there. And then O to M. So have, uh, pause the video, have a quick go, and we'll catch up in a few seconds. Okay, pow, let's go. So the first thing we need is C to D. Now, I think what we need to do is pick a root. I always pick a root, right? So here's C and we need to get to D. The best way to go is to go back to O and then from O to D, okay? So the route that I'm taking there is from C to D, I'm going from C to O, and then I'm gonna add on O to D, there we go. So now C to D is equal to C to O, remember you're going against A there, you're going in the opposite direction, so that there's minus A, and then you're going in the same direction as B, so plus B. So that's that, nice and simple to begin with. And then O to M. So again, I'm gonna pick a root from O to M. The root I'm gonna go with is from O to C and then from C to M. Now, why the hell did I do that? Well, because from O to M, if we go that route there, then what we're doing is going O to C and then C to M. But C to M, as you can see, you can see, yeah, is gonna be half of C to D. And we already worked out C to D, right? So don't create more work for yourself. Use what you've already got in the question. So now just plug all the stuff in. O to C is just A plus a half of C to D. So that's minus A plus B. Times that out, collect it all together, right? So we're gonna have A take away half um, A and then plus a half B. Bring that all together, we would have a half A plus a half B. Factorize that out, we've got half A plus B. Boom, there we go. Done, sorted. And that's it. Hopefully you've got that. Um, and that's all for today. There's another practice one coming up very, very soon. Make sure you keep practicing. Exams are just around the corner. Very, very important, obviously. Um, so all the best till then. I'll catch you again soon.